Alrighty guys, it is Milky Kitty here. Welcome to another Ulala test server video. And today is going to be on SS7 again. Um, reason being, uh, there are, um, oh, it's not a new day yet, so I don't have dice. Uh, that's kind of awkward. Um, so in the first video, I showed you that you know, I showed you the board, and there's a bunch of fruit and whatnot, and you got the coin thing going on. Um, now, they have two different boards in this game mode, well, this season. Um, let me show you on the map here. So, right here, you start off on Primitive Plains, and then whatever, whatever. So every other area is a different board. So this is the fruit board. This is the board I'm about to show you. And then this is the fruit board. And then this is the new board, etc. So it just flip flops every other area. Now, um, this will look pretty similar to you if you played the Monopoly board seasons before. But it's different. Um, Man, I really wish I had dice to show you. But basically, you go around and you land on these things, and they give you buffs. Now, the buffs are different than before. Um, the boss fight, it, it works um, a lot differently than before. It's not a traditional boss fight where it's just, oh, there's the boss, and then you have your team, and, you know, your skill damage can get increased, blah, 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 blah. Um... I guess first major thing that changed is there's no more like vendor because like there's no like coins that are spent um, in this so there's no more vendor um, they still have this where uh, every X amount of things you get you get the the thing that takes down its HP um, now this bottom part here is new now, oh man, I can't stop yawning. So this is your attack value. So like I said, it, it doesn't matter. Now, the great thing about this is it doesn't actually matter how strong your team is outside the game. Everyone is equal in terms of strength in this season, which... Is really good. I'm really glad they found a way to incorporate this. Um, this is your attack. This is your crit. This this says blast injury. I don't even know what that means. Um, this is your combo rate, and this is the number of attacks you do. So how the boss fight works is you go around the board, get your buffs, and then you go to the boss fight. Now you enter, and you attack. Now let me go back to that screen. This is the number of attacks you do. So five. If I go to the boss, my I do five attacks to the boss. And each attack is gonna do a thousand and ninety four damage. If I crit, it'll do two thousand one hundred and eighty eight damage. And if I'm lucky enough to combo, I'll do two attacks for like one attack. So I do an extra attack basically. And then this blast, I don't know what the hell this is. I can't tell you. But everyone has this at the same number, so whatever. Um and then this is your like power, so to speak. Um so like I said, everyone starts out with like the same stats and then it just increases as you go. So that w that's really great for them to change it to this way because it it stops like the you know omega strong teams from having an easier experience than the weaker teams because granted it does scale based off your power but if you were like the top players in the server it was never scaled like enough for you to where you could actually struggle um so i i really like this instead of it just being like because also once you got to a point it was just at the point where 
okay, you go, you use your dice, you go to the vendor, you buy the like slashing thing to take off five or ten percent HP, and and that was it because you did no damage to the boss, and that just kind of like really ruined the gameplay. So I really love this change, I really do. Now I will say on the test server right now, this thing is like they they didn't find the values of like balancing this beforehand. What I mean by that is, in short, it takes forever to get to the next area. Um, I am like a thousand percent sure this will change in the main servers, at least I can hope. Um, because, as you can see, I'm buying, I don't have access to this druid, but on three accounts, we'll just say that, on three accounts, I'm using up all my dice from my bag, I'm buying the five dice, and of course the free dice you get. I'm using all of that and I'm not even going through one area a day. Um, which doesn't sound like a big deal. But considering the seasons are only 30 days. And you don't get AFK rewards until you beat the first area. So the first day I used all my dice. And I didn't even get past the first area. And so I had zero AFK rewards for the first 24 hours. That's not good. They should at least, you know, allow you to pass the first board on the first day. Um, but, yeah, I, I'm i sure they're going to change that. Uh, but, yeah, uh, let's, let's, go, let's get back into this. So, you know what, let me go to my other team real quick. Because I don't think I did theirs yet on this reset. So, let me go. No, we'll, we'll just go to the Shaman. Alrighty here. Yep, yep, yep. Um, okay. No, I did not do it yet. Didn't even click the rewards. Okay, so um Yeah, so let me let me just use some dice real quick. Um Yeah, so these uh these buffs are like this is a attack I think and I, I don't know, but there's like the combo rate and the crit rate basically um let me just keep going here oh yeah they have this one feature that like um you can like choose when you do it it'll like sacrifice one boost for another boost so right there like this one went down a level but in turn this one went up a level um i think uh that one's random so it's it's whatever i guess um Hopefully I don't kill the boss beforehand, because I'm pretty sure if I kill the boss, I'll go to the next area, which is nice, but for purposes of this video, I do not want to kill the boss yet. Um, yeah, so the, you still have this one thing. The, when you land on the, the orb thing, you can still like do the thing where you choose um, like a specific uh, like class of um, buffs. So, nice voice crack. Sacrifice thing again. Keep going. Okay, now here is the boss fight. So you go here and then click on fight. And as you can see, there's no team configuration. You know, like I said, none of, none of that matters in this. So you go, you see I'm hitting it, crit, crit, and boom, I kill it. I got a bunch of coins. Um, it wasn't enough to pass, which. Um, is whatever. Um, let me use more dice here because I believe I'll be able to go again and show you it again. Uh, let's see, do I got? Yeah, I do have these. Um, but yeah, I I personally really like that they changed um the season to this. Like I expressed before, it, it balances it out for everyone. Obviously, you know, if you're free to play, you'll still be at a disadvantage, quote unquote. But your only disadvantage is just the amount of dice, which obviously matters in the grand scheme of things. But what really was making it harder for the new players and, um, you know, the free to play as they're generally weaker than the pay to play players is 
the power thing. So, I I really like this. Yep, yep, keep going. Getting unlucky. I'll just do this. Keep going. Okay, so here's another boss fight. So I can show you that again. So yeah, let me, so I got five attacks. I should do 1144 each attack. My crit rate is actually really low. Um, I guess I was not lucky enough to get the crit rate things. And my combo rate is 14%. So let's see. Four, five, six. Yeah, so I had some combos in there. I did six instead of five. Um, so yeah, there's that. And of course I had some crits in there. So yeah. Um, that's pretty much all I wanted to show you guys for SS7. Um, because I wasn't able to get to that second board on that first day. So I wasn't able to show you that. Um, yeah, that is it and um, thank you so much for watching um i've been putting it in the description now but if you guys have any suggestions for other videos to make um even if it's not test server related like you just want me to play my normal accounts that i have then you know whatever it is just let me know um as long as it's ulala related of course um just put that in the comment below um but yeah uh, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.